long part. I have to say thank you for uh, to everybody, but it's very important for me because all the people that I mentioned had a huge influence uh, on my career. It wouldn't, if it would not be for them, I would not be able to to be where I am right now. So um, <clears throat> yeah, today I. Uh, Everybody knows it's not a surprise. I announced my retirement. There's no tears. I'm very happy to do it. It's, uh, it takes a lot of discipline, though, to retire on top. Um, it's, uh, it's a it, it was a long process in my mind, and, uh, but uh, it's time to do it. Uh, only a few people have done it. And I always said that uh, I want to retire on my own and not be told to retire. So uh, it takes disciplines and, uh, and combat sport and full contact sport, that's how you should retire. You should retire on top. And uh, that is very hard to do. And I'm happy I had the discipline and, and the wisdom to do it. Uh, I want to say thank you first to uh, uh, Lorenzo, Frank Fartita, uh, Dana White, uh, Joe Silva also, and all the UFC staff. These people, they all work very hard, and if it would not be for them, uh, the sport would never exist. All this would, uh, would never exist. <clears throat> I want to say thank you to my trainers, also Feraz Zahabi, uh, Christophe Midou, John Danauer, Greg Jackson, Phil Nurse, Freddie Roach, Howard Grant, Stéphane Larouche, Victor Thériault, Victor and David Zibberman, Patrick Beauchamp, Marc Eli Toussaint, Jonathan Chamber, Bruno Fernandez, Hanzo Gracie, and Gavin McMillan. All these guys, they've been training me. Uh, they're training me right now. Some have been training me in the past. Uh, some I see more often than others. All my training gravitate around Montreal, New York, uh, Los Angeles, and Albuquerque, New Mexico. So uh, I have a lot of people. And thank you to all of them. Thank you to all the people that, that manage me that uh, my advise, advisor and manager, um, Rodolphe Beaulieu, Philippe Lepage, they, these guys are more than advisor. J Justin King Kingsley also, they, they're friends to me. I can call them in the middle of the night and they will wake up and help me out. So they take me out of situation that was very bad and uh, I'm very glad they're not only business people related, they're friend to me. Thank you to Nes Balelo, Nick Khan, Markel, and also the, all the CAA team, and also the, the people that helped me in the past, Stefan Patry, Sherry Spencer, had a, a lot of, the career of an, of an athlete, it's not a straight line. Sometimes it's a curve up, you, you have an obstacle up, down, and it's important right now and, and to this day that I remember the positive of everything. All right, so uh, thank you to all of them. Um, when I was young, the reason why I, I started doing mixed martial arts is because I watched Royce Gracie growing up when he won the first UFC. And at that, that particular moment, I knew exactly that's what I wanted to do. It's weird, it's like I had a, a vision. And I wanna say thank you to Royce Gracie to add and inspire me. Also thank you to uh, Jean-Yves Thériault uh, to have inspired me not only as an athlete, as a good role model. And thank you to Wayne Gretzky. Wayne Gretzky is probably the best athlete all sport combined. His record would probably never been broken. And um, not only that he's an incredible athlete for me, he's an incredible role model. And through my career, I always try to mold myself like, uh, like Wayne Gretzky. I always wanted to be like Wayne Gretzky. And uh, I'm a huge fan of Wayne Gretzky. And uh, I remember I, I used to watch him when he won the Stanley Cup. I was very young. My, my dad used to wake me up every time the Oilers won. And I, there was, there was, uh, the Oilers was my team. Sorry for Montreal Canadian. I know I'm in the Bell Center, but they used to be uh, my team. And Wayne Gretzky was my idol growing up. So um, thanks for the inspiration. Everything start with a dream. And um, I was able to, to have a dream because of, of, of these guys. And um, thanks to uh, the, the Bell Center, to organizing all this, the reporter, everybody that, that had support me. And uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs>